What to do when you can't sleep at 4 o'clock in the morning? I know. Start an Arduino project. All right, so it's 517. This took me just a little over an hour to throw together this project. Any ideas what it is? Well, let's look a little bit closer. This is an Arduino RF field strength meter. And all we're using here is a Nano, a NeoPixel ring, and a little RF detector. This is just a simple circuit. This white wire here is our antenna. These diodes rectify the RF into DC, which is fed over into our analog zero port that reads it. Then the Arduino acts upon it and lights up a corresponding number of NeoPixels. Here's the circuit diagram. Antenna comes in, gets uh, RF gets rectified into DC, goes into A0, Arduino magic, the NeoPixel signal is sent out on pin 3. Nothing to it. Let's look at the code. Okay, let's have a look at the code. First of all, we need to include the NeoPixel library. And then I'm doing some defines here. I just like to use defines for things that don't change. RFN comes in on pin 0. NeoPixels are on pin 3. And the number of pixels is 24. Then we just have some variables here that we're using for our calculations. You'll see how they work out in the code down below. Then we create an instance of the Adafruit NeoPixels library called pixels with the following parameters that we defined up above. Setup is only one thing, pixels.begin. Then we begin our loop, and the first thing in our loop is another loop, because we're going to do averaging to kind of smooth things out. So we're going to take 20 readings, for integer n equals 0, n is less than 20, n increment. And then we're going to read the level from our RF in pin and we're going to map it to the number of NeoPixels and then we're going to keep a running count by saying average equals average plus RF strength and when we drop out of that loop it will take our average by saying average level is average divided by 20 since we took 20 readings then we're going to light up the appropriate number of NeoPixels so for integer m equals 0 m less than average level n increment and we say pixels dot set pixel color which pixel to light light it in this case i'm just making them green so they are of course you know uh red green blue you could change this make it whatever you want then we give the command pixels dot, uh, dot show which lights them up and finally then we shut them off. And I know this is sloppy code, but I could not get it to work in a for loop, so I just did it this way. This just sets them all back to zero. And the final step is we reset our counter. That's all there is to it. Pretty darn easy. All right, the code is uploaded. Let's power this guy up here. If I can find the right wire. So then we're going to need an RF signal source, and for that we're going to use the Baofeng radio. And I don't know if you can see that. It is set for uh, FRS service, which is a frequency that does not need a license, because I have not got my license as of yet. Passed the test, just got to wait for it to show up. So all that we need to do then is key the radio. And we move the, this in, and ba-boom, babushka. The closer we get, the more pixels light. And this will give you an idea of your signal strength. Pretty simple, right? A quick and easy project that now that the work is done, if you wanted this, you could throw it together in about 10 minutes. You could change... Uh, the NeoPixel ring to uh, 
regular LEDs. You could change it so that it displays different colors as the level climbs. Feel free to modify it and use it however you want. I made it for you guys. Well, for me too. Anyway, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe. That's it. I'm out. Peace. Thank you.